Esky up well, looking for camera. Holmes, I think, was uh, waiting for a challenge from Luis Garcia, which never really arrived, and uh, the flag stays down here for Bellamy, who looked around and felt sure, I think, that he was offside, and the referee's assistant on the near side, Nigel Bannister, had a look and appeared to be keeping his flag down momentarily, certainly to start with. Craig Bellamy back in the side today, having been cleared of assault charges during the week. Good running by McCulloch on the far side, but uh, Carrigan nearly let him in there with a second chance. That one's come off Boyce and it's fallen rather nicely here for Bellamy. Great chance for Liverpool! And the wheat's turned out rather well for Craig Bellamy. It's the first time Liverpool have scored in open play away from home in the league since last May. And it's taken them nine minutes today. Ten hours and 19 minutes. And finally Liverpool score on the road in the league. Bellamy didn't need inviting twice. And what must have been a stressful, worrisome week for him is now turning out rather well in more ways than one as Craig Bellamy scores his second Premiership goal for Liverpool. After this, Paul Jewell sees his team travel to West Ham and Middlesbrough before they uh, host Arsenal, so a couple of away games coming up for Wigan. Spoko merely gives it away. Wigan looking for offside, which doesn't come. Great chance here for 2-0, and Bellamy gobbles it up! 25 minutes in, and Liverpool lead Wigan by two goals to nil. And Craig Bellamy has his second goal of the game, back in the Liverpool starting eleven. Beautifully set up, Wigan half looking for offside, they would never get it there. Skoko giving the ball away via Gerrard and Jackson beaten for pace by Bellamy who kept a cool head it's a long way back now for Wigan Emerson Boyce in towards Sean a good save chance for McCullough oh and he won't get a better chance than that for the rest of the day Wigan had a route back into the game there. Good save. Firstly to deny the Austrian and then McCulloch unable to take advantage. Walks in towards Heskey. Reina made himself look big. And camera blasts it wide. Well, Wigan have had a couple of chances in this first half. The high floated ball inadvertently headed back into the penalty area. Rayner did rather well there to block Heskey and Camera rather hacked at the chance. Wigan have yet to score a goal against Liverpool, never mind get a point against them, ever, not just while he's been in charge. It's a little too high and long, and it is. Matt Jackson have gone up for that one. He might need to make tracks back into his own half rather rapidly now because here come Liverpool with Steven Gerrard. Always away from the defender here. It's a chance for Bellamy for the hat-trick. Unselfish play and Cal makes it three. That's a smashing goal from Liverpool to cap an excellent first-half performance. And Dirk Count has his first goal in eight matches. Gerrard setting it up with the initial pass, then another one to Bellamy. He wasn't greedy, Cal was in a better spot. Wigan Athletic are not going to get anything from this match whatsoever. Cout, Bellamy strides forward in the centre. Oh, and that was a terrific interception there by Leighton Baines. It needed to be as well because Bellamy was waiting there close to goal. Gerard, oh it's a dangerous one, oh and it's gone in, it's an own goal, it goes in off Lee McCulloch, well he missed a chance at one end and he put one away, he'd rather not at the other, these sort of balls are so difficult to deal with, it strikes McCulloch and Kirkland just can't react.
What a thrashing for Wigan. Spoko and Baines looked as though they haven't quite worked this one out yet. Will it be a blast from Baines? No. It'll be a flutter from Skoko and the flag's up near side. Shana was there, but the flag went up straight away. Wigan very nearly on the board. And Nigel Bannister quick with the flag as the ball was played up, and there we can see Shana just offside as he beats Rayner. I think he's going to have to just write this one off. Towards Heskey, Shana's there. Chance for Camera. Agger with the block. Heskey! Oh, so unlucky. It hit Cottrell in the end and bounced away. Heskey was close to a goal against his old teammates there. Camera, the first effort. Agger inadvertently setting up Heskey. And just look at Cottrell there at the far post. Before he knew it, the ball had bounced off his leg and wide.